Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the video, guys. Today, we're going to be using greats of the game, Zidane, and also Holly. We're going to be testing them out, seeing how good they are, guys, in this video. I'm going to be using them in the striker position, 5-5, five, 6-3, five, high, high work rates. Absolute monster of a card. Now, you can use them in a, in a wide, different, plethora of different Wherever you guys want to use this card, you can use him. You want to use him as center mid, fine. Cam, fine. Winger, fine. Center back, CDM, center mid, strike. I don't care. Then we're also going to be looking at Zidane. Again, high, high, five star. Five star, I'm sure Zidane is 6'2 or 6'1. Guys, they've both got the finesse shot playstyle plus. And that is my go-to way of finishing in this game. These cars look absolutely insane. The dribbling on both big men are fantastic, guys. These are some of the best icons in the game. And wow. Let's talk about what I saw. Uh, what did I think? And yeah, I want to discuss them. First of all, I want to say I'm playing both players out of position. Why? Because I don't care about the game. I just want to have fun. And I just thought to myself, they've both got cracking shooting. Why not? Now, the better player is obviously Hullet. I think Hullet... Is genuinely like one of them cracked cards especially now being five star five star he's always got five star weak foot but this one's got five star skills and I thought it was a really good variation I I love this card with five star skills I just think he suits everything that comes his way of course every single team I faced this weekend league was absolutely insane I was I was just shocked at people's teams. People's teams are ridiculous. But yeah, we'll have to talk about Hullet first because I felt like he was better than Zidane. But then he's going to be better than Zidane. He's like three times, four times his price. Zidane's like 600k and Hullet's about 2.4 million coins. So there's a big difference in price. Hullet, his finishing was absolutely brilliant. His passing, his attack positioning. I can't believe like how good his shooting was from outside of the box with that, fi uh, with that finish shot place out plus. You can't bully him off the board from the ball off the ball at all. He's just so big and strong. He's ridiculous. And also, if you guys like crossing the ball in, I'm sure this guard's got aerial playstyle plus. And the reason why is because when I had him in the striker position, he was tracking back at times and he was winning headers for me. And actually, that was really, really good. He's got the anticipate plus as well. And the reason why I know that is because he did do some defensive duties for me, even though being a striker. Like, because he's got high, high work rate, sometimes I saw him pushing back and doing defending for me, which was a really, really welcome addition to this card. I can't really say anything about this card that I didn't like. I loved his shooting. I loved his pace. I can't believe how fast he is for somebody so big. He's 6'3". He's a truck of a man. He's absolutely massive. His dribbling, his passing... His physicality is unmatched, in my opinion. I, I think he's one of the most physical players in the game. Just considering everything that he brought to the table, just brilliant. The only thing I would say, just being a bit picky, is probably his agility isn't the best. But when you consider how big he is, his agility is crazy. Like He's such a big human being. I think he's one of the biggest footballer players that I've ever seen because I've even seen him in IRL play. Like, obviously, I've not gone to watch him play, but I've watched his highlights and he, he looks like he's the only adult on the pitch. He's absolutely massive. And then on top of that, he's got them, he's got the huge dreads and the huge neck and he's just a physical specimen, a genetically blessed football player. I love this card to bits. I think this Hullet card is an S tier plus card. I think there's a reason why he's so expensive, even though it's August, mid-August. I just think he vouches that price of 2.3, 2.4 million coins and I'd be happy to pay them coins for this sort of card. His finishing was class water card. Now we're going to talk about Zidane. Now Zidane... Zidane, listen, Zidane's card is really, really good. Like, this is a really good card. But you've got to understand, with Zidane, in my opinion, he doesn't suit the striker position as well. I think he's more of a camera center mid. I think Zidane, I saw him track, track back as well with the high, high work rates and defend. And this, this is one thing he definitely brought to the table. Zidane's shooting is absolutely brilliant. Like, Zidane, when he takes a shot, insane now his shooting is always really really good it's just at times he didn't finish and like there was times he was missing i was just thinking wow but listen it didn't 
it doesn't stop me for saying like he's not the most clinical player in the game absolutely but his shooting is absolutely insane and you can see the the power behind his shot as well it absolutely flies in his passing majestic his dribbling for a big man coupled with his agility and balance was very 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 impressive i felt like he was like zidane's got like one of them body types that is quite big he's got quite a bit of a stock to him but when you use the strength button he feels so strong on the ball he's five star five star so you can skill he's so strong he's 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 a brilliant card as well i don't think he's as good as holly i felt like his attack positioning in the box wasn't as good as holly neither was his finishing but still an outstanding card and listen zidane's one of my my favorite players ever if you talk about my three icons i love to bit zidane van basten r9 yeah, I love these guys to bit. Zidane was brilliant, man. I honestly, I loved using him. His finishing was class. And uh, I really, really enjoyed using him. Uh, he's not quite S tier plus, but he's definitely an S, -S, S tier card. I feel like I used him in the wrong position. And that's one thing I'm going to say in the review. I don't think he fits that striker position really well. But one thing I will definitely say is Senemid Cam CDM. I think he fits that to a T. Okay. And uh, that's where I would play Zidane. But I'd say Hullet. The thing is with Hullet, you can use him anywhere. I also use Neymar on all gen. And this guy is just a machine. Like he, This is a different level sort of card. This is an S tier plus card in my opinion, Neymar. And I can't believe how cheap he is. He's like 550,000 coins for this sort of card. He absolutely was turning defenders like it was nothing. And, you know, when I started off with Neymar and then did sell him, yeah, I played five games with him and won four, lost one. Like he's such a good card in champs. He's still like you. Listen, it's the time of the game where I think hardcore people are playing the game. Everyone's got a good team, so don't be surprised. You can still beat them though if you use your players effectively, right? So Neymar was absolutely class for me, man. Absolute class. His agility, balance, his finishing, the way he feels on the ball, it's just beautiful. He's got that beautiful body type as well. I have just about unlocked 99 Haaland as well, so I'll be interested to use him. But anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe. And guys, that was a video of me using Zidane and Holly. And yeah, it was brilliant. It was such a laugh. Thanks. Zidane!